Hey everybody, how you doing? Thanks for joining us for our Monday story time. And guess who I brought with me? A bunch of superheroes. We have Rocket Raccoon, Iron Man, Captain America, Batman Beyond, Flash, and our giraffe. Our superhero giraffe is with us too. Look at that. Everybody say hi. Hello, hi. Hey, everybody's saying hi to you. Wow. Okay. Now we're going to read a superhero book. And it's called Even Superheroes Have a Bad Day by Shelley Becker. So we're going to learn a story about superheroes. So that's why we brought a whole bunch of superheroes with us. So we'll put everybody down here. And then they can sit over here. And they can watch us. Okay, you guys watch over here, okay? Thank you. Okay, let's do our book here. Let's turn it this way a little bit. And, all, and they can sit here and they can watch us. Okay. Even Superheroes Have a Bad Day by Shelley Becker. Look at them. They're all getting wet in the rain. All these superheroes. Wow. They have some cool costumes. Okay, so we're going to find out what's going on. I like superheroes. Oh, they have some names. Okay. Here's, he's Beastie, this big guy. She's Zing. Zing. She is Thrash. Is her name, Thrash. And he is Laser Man. He's got lasers coming out of his eyes. Laser Man. Wow. Oh, they look angry. Even Supergirls have a bad day. They look frustrated, sad. So let's see. When Supergirls don't get their way, when they're sad, when they're mad, when they have a bad day. Uh-oh. Looks like he just kicked that because he's mad. Ooh, that's not nice. They could use superpowers to kick, punch, and pound. They could shriek, they could screech with an ear-piercing sound. Hmm. Hopefully they won't. But it shows them all yelling and screaming, having a hissy fit. It's bothering the animals. They could crush wooden crates and bend metal gates. They could throw trucks and buses. Across several states. Look, through that all the way over there. Ooh. They could knock over buildings like towers of blocks and crumble the streets into rubble and rocks. They could use laser eyes to ignite forest fires. Or fling boomerangs to flate the town's tires. Okay, so they're saying he can be mad and punch the building. He can use his laser eyes, see him, and set fires. Mm, I hope they don't do that. But upset superheroes have all sort of choices. Instead of destruction and loud, livid voices. They burn angry steam off with speed of lightning hiking or super extreme outer space mountain biking. She's on her bike on the moon. She's in space on the moon on her bike. Cool. So instead of getting angry, she goes off somewhere and lets off the steam. They they race to the rescue of people in need and delight in the joy of a super good deed. They hatch super plans to help banish world sadness, building fabulous theme parks for giggles and gladness. Oh, look, they're making a ride for people. They're helping people. See, they're fixing it. Wow. See, they're being good. They're being nice. They chase wanted bad guys with supercharged zing. 
dragging hundreds to jail while the police dance and sing. Oh, they got all the bad people. And the police are all happy. Because they caught all the bad people. You notice how the words rhyme? They track down and tame super menacing beasts and transform pity parties to victory feasts. Okay, they caught all these bad guys. All these silly looking monsters. Look at them all. But displeased superheroes who don't feel serene could have super temptation to cause a bad scene. He's mad and he's yelling, messing up all the trucks and the cars. They could blast icy blizzards on hot afternoons or walloping twisters and monster typhoons. Oh look, it's messing up the beach. There's a twister there. Making the water icy and a big typhoon is coming. Uh-oh. It didn't say they did. It says they could do this. They could spin spider webs super far, super sticky, and tangle up towns with their silk super icky. They could rotate the planet and mess up world time. Or sit back and relax while the world fills with crime. Okay, so if he wanted, he could make it all sticky in the town, his spider web. Or mess around with the Earth's time, make it go backwards. Or just sit here, see him sitting there, and not help out when there's a crime and bad guys. Instead, they dig down to their super best part. The strong superpowers contained in their heart. And using their talents as true heroes should. They battled the urge to do harm. Even though they could. They acknowledge their sorrow. Their anger. Their pain. As they wait for their super emotions to wane. So they're getting all nice and calm. So they're not angry or mad. They're calming themselves down. Breathing. So when we get mad and angry and frustrated, we shouldn't get mad at people. We should calm down, breathe. <sighs> Take three big deep breaths. Or give ourselves a big hug. You know, until we calm down. Sometimes we just need to go alone in our bedroom. Can we become nice again and we calm down? It's okay if they frown. It's okay if they sigh. It's even okay if they slump down and cry. But when they get up and get on their day, here they are. A little sad. He's crying. But they get up. And they're going to start their day. But when they get up and get on with their day, saving the world is their most super way. Here they go. They're ready now. They're not sad anymore. They're not angry anymore. They're not frustrated. They're ready to go save the day. And at the end of the day, they get together and hang out and go camping. Look at that. Singing songs. Having fun. Having marshmallows. <laughs> he's making marshmallows in the fire. And he's doing it with his laser eyes. Look at that. Laser eyes. Cooking his own marshmallow. And their name is Magnifique, Screecher, Typhoon, and Icky. Here's the other superheroes. So this side, to the front, we have these heroes. Laser Man, Thrash, Zing, and Beastie. And this side, we have the other heroes. Icky, Typhoon, Screech, and Magnifique. Very cool. So, so it was telling us, 
Even superheroes sometimes have a bad day. Do you guys have a bad day sometimes? Yeah? Oh, yeah, okay. So, even superheroes have bad days, just like us. We have bad days sometimes. But are we supposed to be mean? Are we supposed to knock things over? We're we supposed to make people scared or yell at people? No. We need to learn to control our emotions, how we feel. So, what we need to do is get alone, maybe stand in the back of the room, side of the room, or go back to your bedroom if you're at home. Or if you're outside playing, go go stand by the fence or something. And calm down. Maybe come sit down by the teacher till you calm down. And uh, you can help breathe. I like to breathe three times. Really deep breaths, because then it makes the back of my head tingle. Because oxygen goes to my brain. So you can go... And you make your head tingle a little bit. And that gives oxygen to your brain. That helps you calm down. Or if you're just so frustrated angry. You can you can take your hands. And you can do this. Twist your arms. And you can do like what we call a pretzel. And you can twist like this. And do a pretzel. You can go like this. And let it out. Or you can squeeze your hands. And just let out all the sadness. Let out all the... Oh, if you're angry, you can just let it out. Don't let it out by kicking or hitting anybody. But you can just let it out like that. Sometimes I'll just go like this. Uh, let it all out through my fingers. If I get frustrated or sad. So, we're all going to have different feelings at different times. And we're not always going to be happy together. But some of us will be sad at times. Now, if you notice your friend is sad, you can go up to them and give them a hug and... And see if they're okay. But if they're angry and they're mad, just leave them alone and let them calm down all by themselves, okay? And the teacher maybe will come and help them calm down. But those are ways that we can make sure that we can still be heroes. Because, you know, bad guys, when they get angry, they become mean. They don't control when they're mad. They just want to get mean and kick things, knock things over. Scare people, yell at people. Yeah, that's not very nice. But we are heroes. And we have God's love in us. And we should behave like superheroes. And we should be nice. And But, you know, if we have these feelings, then we need to make sure that we take the time to let them out privately. Okay, and just go off. And if you need a hug from your teacher... Come tell your teacher you're just angry and mad, and I'll help you breathe. Your teacher will help you breathe. Or if you just need a hug, your teacher will give you a hug, okay? So, even superheroes are like us. They get sad and angry at different times, too. Frustrated and all. So, but they handle it the right way. They don't handle it like bad guys who, who you know, bother people or mean to other people. No. So we need to make sure that we do that, okay? And also, when I'm having a bad day, I pray to God and God helps me. God gives me his superpowers. It helps me to calm down. So that's also something good to do, too, is ask God to help you, not be mad. Okay? I hope you enjoyed the story. I enjoyed the story very much, guys. You guys did a good job. So this is must be what you do sometimes when you guys get frustrated and angry. Yeah? Okay. Well, say goodbye to the boys and girls. Okay, say goodbye. Bye. Yeah. Well, Captain Mary hopped out. Okay, bye-bye. We'll see you guys later. Okay, Captain Mary, get back in your seat before you fall out again. Okay. Okay, we'll see you guys later, okay? Love you guys. Enjoy this week. Remember, you watch your videos every day. See you later. Bye-bye. Rocket, you want to say goodbye? Oh, there's Rocket. Okay, he's going to say goodbye. We'll see you later.